I pop to a local shop and I'm met outside by a man with white hair selling fake red flowers from a cardboard box. He smiles and asks with loud silence for a donation, for a mark of respect. I'm not sure how I feel about this. I talk about the boys I went to school with recruited before they could properly shave. He talks about sacrifices made about emptiness people find on returning and coldness shown to those who can't recover. I speak about the men I drank with, who accepted those astronomical costs only to find that the war they fought was little more than criminal greed. And he says, exactly. Your boys, your boys are the same as mine. These flowers aren't for the wars, they're for the men. The men and women whose nightmares run red. The men and women with shattered parts who never fully come home. The men and women who care for the broken and mourn the lost and raise the children with little or no help. And I hate that he's right. I put my pound in the slot and attempt to pin the plastic stalk in a way that won't immediately fall off and I see an image from my childhood. Thousands of crosses in a field in France. And I know I will join the silence. Because these poppies, they're not for the wars. They're for the men and women who must live after them. Because war, war leaves devastation on every side. And until we build a world where war is not welcome, then we must be prepared to help those whose lives it's broken. Because this is everyone's world. And a few coins is a very little cost. <laughs>